What's good, R&B squad? This is Heart of Ruth. I trust that this message meets you guys in good spirits. If you're new here, welcome. We don't believe that you're here by accident. We're happy to have you, and Jesus is even happier. I bring glad tidings to you guys today, and I pray that this word blesses whoever it is for, just as much as it blessed me when I first heard it. For whoever this is for, bless you. Bless you in advance, okay? The Lord took me to Matthew chapter 24, verse 44, and that reads, Therefore be ye also ready, for in such an hour as ye think not, the Son of Man cometh. And the Lord showed me a couple things. The first thing he showed me was a baby, and the baby came earlier than expected. Okay? There was emphasis on earlier than expected instead of premature. It's as if the Lord wanted to make the distinction between the two. There's a difference between something arriving early and something being premature. Okay? So there's that. Then the Lord showed me a vehicle. He showed me a four-wheeled wagon and a runner, which is an indication of movement, of quick, rapid movement. Okay? And then the Lord took me to... Isaiah chapter 62 verse 6 and that reads, I have set watchmen upon thy walls, O Jerusalem, which shall never hold their peace day nor night. Ye that make mention of the Lord keep not silence. Okay? And the Lord is saying to someone today, whatever it is he promised you, it is coming sooner, a lot sooner than you expected. You're currently in labor and you may not even know it. That baby that you're birthing. Do you guys remember some time back a couple months ago, the Lord gave us a word about being in labor and about the promise being about to be birthed? You're in the process right now of giving birth. And you may be aware of it or you may not be aware of it because some of you are not experiencing any labor pains at all in the spirit and some of you are experiencing labor pains this child this baby this promise is being birthed earlier than expected all right and it's not something that is going to happen before its time it is right on time even though it's earlier than expected okay god does not make any mistakes and the lord also took me to psalm 119 verse 89 forever O lord your word is settled in heaven the lord is saying that it's a done deal it's settled it's permanent this thing that you're giving birth to this promise that you're giving birth to it is permanent it is fixed it is settled it's written in stone in heaven and on earth amen he also took me to Matthew chapter 7, verse 7. Ask, and it shall be given you. Seek, and ye shall find. Knock, and it shall be opened unto you. So going back to the Isaiah chapter 62, verse 6, there are people who have been watching over your promise for you. There are good people that the Lord has put into your life, and they have been praying for this thing to come to fruition. They've been praying for this thing to be birthed. For some of you, it's your marriage promise, and your person has been praying for you. They've been acting as watchmen over this promise, okay? For some of you, it's something else. It is a career that's about to take off. It is a business opportunity that's about to happen. It's ministry that's about to take off. Whatever the Lord has been promising you for some time, you're about to give birth to that thing sooner than you expect it to. And it will be an established thing when it takes place. Glory to God. I hope that this word bless someone and I will be back with another word as soon as the Lord releases me. Take care.